What's up guys, it's Misha with Winnie Designs and today I'm going to show you how to make the best chalkboard that you can possibly do. Basically, here's the material that we used to, to put it on here. We went right over our two by fours, but we went with a three quarter inch MDF piece of kind of wood. The reason we went with this, it's super strong. It's nice and smooth so you don't get that wood grain and it's much cheaper than getting like a uh, piece of maple plywood or something like that. Once we put it, put it on, uh, we use just a nail gun because I'm going to be able to take this down. But if you want it more permanent, use screws. It will hold much better. Um, after we did that, I used this uh, this putty wood wood filler here to basically go over it. And uh, it almost acted like compound. It almost acted like compound here. So I would just use a three inch putty knife, smoothed it out and now it's ready to go. So all I'm gonna do now is grab a palm sander, not a palm sander, just a hand sponge, and then go over it nice and easy and clean it up. You could get a palm sander if you wanted to, but I don't wanna to get too aggressive on the, on the wood itself. Just wanna clean it up. Then we're going to prime it and then start putting on the chalk paint. So let's go. All right, so we got everything sanded. Now we're going to use this Kills primer. This is like a heavy duty primer that I'm going to put on here. As you can see, I was sanding more than just my spots because I want the whole thing to kind of have a little bit of that textured surface so that the primer can stick to it and then the chalk paint can stick to it. So we're going to put this primer on and then you'll see me sanding it really lightly as well just to make it a little smoother, all right? So that's next. Okay, so now we're going to grab a sand pole, one of these guys, and just really lightly, I'm not trying to sand it off, but I do want to make it a little smoother, so I'm just going to lightly sand it. All right, so now we're going to actually get the chalk paint on it, and make sure it says chalk board, not just chalk paint, because there's like chalk paint for your furniture, I guess. Make sure you're getting this exact paint right here. Take a picture of that, bang. So we're going to uh, use our brush, Cut around the perimeter and then to roll it out i'm going to be using a foam roller here and not a nap like kind of the cloth roller because this will give you a better smooth finish so let's go all right so our first coat has dried and it's looking sharp but you can still kind of see right through it a little bit uh, so what i'm going to do is i'm going to get a sponge here a sanding sponge and then very lightly, just circular motions, and scratch it up a little bit and get any boogers that might be on there, like a little specks, this will clean it up. We're going to then kind of sweep it and then paint it again for a second coat. All right, so our chalkboard is done. We added a bench and some modern looking ship up. Uh, we're going to use this chalkboard to kind of jet, jot down notes for you know tutorials that we're doing. The whole space here is going to be to educate people on construction and make some cool stuff happen. So make sure that you subscribe and like this video. Thanks. <laughs> 